My name is Patricia Tabon. So what were some of your friends' like, rank if you knew? Okay, um, I know your grandma, Dan, uh, retired as an E9. Um, Renee Asuncion retired as Warrant Officer 4. I believe Dr. Bermisa, who was a doctor at the Coast Guard base here in Kodiak, he retired as a captain. Was it hard on them because of their race? They said it was the first few years after they joined, but after a while when they get, um, I think it takes a while to get adjusted or to adapt, but uh, they said that towards the latter years of their services, uh, it was, uh, the opportunities were there for them too. Yourself? My name is Clinton Rosales, born in Gataran, Cagayan, Philippines, April 14, 1946. Overall in the Coast Guard, it, it is a very, very nice outfit because when we go out, we save lives at sea. The first time I was aboard ship, whereas when I was in Norfolk, Virginia, my ship was the Coast Guard Cutter Cherokee. And my first thing I, I had was then I always start, because I wasn't used. I got seasick, I was calling Ralph here and there, Ralph, Ralph here, Ralph there. And uh, the ship was really small and we were trying to save this big one. And the wave was so high that when it goes up, you cannot see the ship. And the only time when it goes, goes out, the waves are so big. When I retired, I was a first class petty officer, machinery technician. But when I was, uh, when we were recruited, we were recruited as a steward. After my four years term, I was about to get out. But then they sent me to school, which is uh, the Engineering School in Yorktown, Virginia. So instead of steward's man, I was an engineman. So I worked machineries aboard ship. So most of my career are aboard ships. My first, just like what I said a while ago, my first ship was the Cherokee, but I was a steward then. Then about two, uh, two years later, I got transferred to another ship, which was the Gresham. After the Gresham, I got transferred. Oh, I went, then I went to school then, because my four years tour was uh, almost over. They sent me to school to Yorktown, Virginia. After my school, I went to Baltimore, Maryland, the Coast Guard Cutter Chinook. And you know what is my next duty stay, uh, next uh, job aboard ship? When the cook is uh, on leave or an emergency or something, my collateral duty is as a cook. <laughs> yeah, so I, I, my job was jack of all trades, master of none. <laughs> Before, when I was in boot camp, they even called me uh, Mexican or Puerto Rican. And one of them, I remember his name, he was, he was in my, my boot mate. His name was uh, Anthony Quinn. He is from Texas. You know what he, he, asked, he asked me? He says, hey, Clint, is it true that you people in the Philippines live on top of the trees? That's what he, uh, he told me, you know? You know what I told him? Oh yeah, we live on top of the tree, but we use elevators. I told him. <laughs> yeah, that's a true, true thing that, uh, you know, I... When I was aboard ship, uh, Coast Guard Cutter... Cutter... Uh, North Wind, that's an icebreaker. Then we load the helicopter because we do icebreaking in the Arctic. That was again a 
That's another duty there when I had, uh, I was our first class then. My name is Angelito Labe, and I was born in the Philippines, May 31st, 1942. The Coast Guard overall is very nice, very nice outfit. Hmm. The Coast Guard, it, it is a very, very nice outfit. Why do I come here? Why do I join the Coast because that's the only way I could come here in the United States. And I, so I could see all this beautiful place, all the nice people with they said uh, land opportunity. That's before. <laughs> I don't know now. Yeah. I was a first class ferry officer. I'm doing we're doing all the cooking in the in the mess hall. <laughs> Just is something my collateral duty is as a cook, <laughs> which uh, all the Coast Guard personnel and some civilian they go there and they eat there. Mm -hmm. That's the only way during those days that we could have is either steward or cook. But later on, they changed the policy. We could change our rate anywhere we wanted. <laughs>